I've said it many times, I know I would change my ways, I know for sure When all the crows decide to meet They settle down beneath my feet I've got it right and I got it wrong Good morning everybody and welcome back to a brand new vlog. I really hope that you guys are doing really well and you're having a really really nice day so far. So, as I just said, it is a vlog. Hello. Excuse my pale ass face. Honestly, I haven't faked hand in a few days and I really need to today. So we're just going to excuse the fact that I look like a ghost. So it is currently Monday morning and it is fairly early actually. I have a Zoom call this morning so I need to get cracking. I'm going to have breakfast first. I have showered. I am pretty much ready for the day apart from I need to do my makeup ready for this Zoom call. Um, that is at 11 and I've still got a good few hours before that. So I'm going to have breakfast. I have been loving yogurt at the moment. If you guys watch my vlogs often, you'll know that in my last one, I did like a yogurt bowl with banana and it was so nice. And I have been craving it ever since. So Callum went food shopping yesterday and he picked up my favorite yogurts at the moment, which are from Aldi. And I showed you in my last vlog, but if you missed it, I'll just get them out. Um, so it's these ones. They are the Brooklyn 25 gram protein pouches. This is in raspberry and it is so good. There's 148 calories in the whole pouch. So I'm gonna have one of those. He did also pick me up a new flavor. So they have peach and passion fruit, which I'm really looking forward to trying. Um, it's the same amount of calories. And again, 25 grams of protein, which is really good. Um, so I'm gonna have one of those today and a banana. And I'm also gonna have some granola with it because I have just been craving that and maybe some strawberries. I'm just gonna have a really nice yogurt bowl. So yeah, I'm gonna make that now. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe to my channel if you're new. I post videos every Wednesday, Friday and Sunday. So let's get making breakfast because I'm actually starving. So these are the ingredients for my breakfast. This is the granola that I'm gonna be using. It is 5% less sugar. There are 209 calories per 45 gram serving and it is nuts and coconut. You know that I love coconut and honestly I love granola. So that is gonna be really nice with this yogurt that I just showed you. And then I've got a few strawberries and a banana. I love my bananas to be like extremely ripe. I just like them to be really soft. So I'm gonna get cutting the fruit and then put it all in the bowl. Okay, so I've had my breakfast and I really need to get a move on now and actually do my makeup. So that's why I'm sat here. I think I have 45 minutes, um, which is actually quite a while to be fair. So I don't know why I'm rushing, but I always get um, worried when I have appointments and I'm not ready like hours before. 
the weather today is honestly so gloomy and any other time apart from this time of the year i would be so happy because i love like gloomy rainy weather in autumn and winter and i know it's winter but i've mentioned a few times over the past couple of weeks oh no i just got primer in my hair i just hate this time of the year and i've had proper january blues this month i just really have not been enjoying this month i'm not sure whether it's because there's nothing to look forward to the weather's awful it's like cold and you haven't even got like christmas to like overshadow the fact that it's cold um but i just really haven't been enjoying it and i'm just ready for spring literally i'm so ready for spring i'll talk you through some of my favorite um beauty products because i know that a lot of you are interested and i've had quite a few questions recently on my makeup so this is the foundation that i use it's the fit me foundation and it's in warm nude which is number 128 um, i'm just knocking all my makeup over this is a little bit too dark at the moment because i've got fake tan on my fake tan is honestly so patchy so just please excuse that so i'm just gonna blend it into my neck so that it looks a little bit better <laughs> but yeah it is definitely too dark for my face at the moment because i haven't got tan on i'm gonna do my tan tonight i think because i really haven't done it for like quite a few days and i hate it and i especially hate being pale in january i feel like having a bit of a tan makes me feel a lot better about the month i don't know if that makes sense the only thing that has really been getting me through this month is going to the gym um that has been a massive endorphin booster um because obviously exercise does release endorphins and i actually weighed myself today for the first time in a while and since christmas i have lost six pounds which i am really happy about i'm really really proud oh that was my computer i'm really really proud um of the progress that i've made so quickly i think i've been going to the gym now for about three weeks so yeah i'm really happy about that and obviously i've been in a calorie deficit and i've been yeah just working hard which i'm glad about because i have never got into the gym before and i feel like i'm properly getting into it now i have got something so nice to show you guys later for dinner um i'm gonna i don't really know what the plan is for today i'm kind of just i know like briefly what i'm gonna do i'm gonna get this meeting out of the way first and then go from there because i'm not entirely sure what time it's gonna finish i need to have a sort out today of my clothes because honestly guys it's out of control it's it's honestly out of control um i haven't sorted out my clothes for a very long time i think probably a good few months and to keep on top of it i feel like i need to do it like every month because it honestly just is ridiculous so i'm gonna do that today and i just need to clear some space because literally if i went out to buy new clothes now i wouldn't have any room in my wardrobe or my drawers like that's how bad it is so i'm gonna do that i'm also gonna do a bit of law of attraction stuff today i might talk you through like my visualization and my like meditation process because so many of you whenever i mention stuff like that you're like really interested and i get loads of comments asking me to talk more about it so i'm probably going to do that today but for dinner oh my gosh i'm going to have like this burrito bowl which i saw on tiktok um but i'll show you how to make that a bit later on because it honestly looks insane so overall we've got quite a productive day um so i'm really looking forward to spending the day with you guys i really can't deal with this patchy fake tan <laughs> really can't deal with it um that is another thing i'm gonna have to do today i'm gonna have to scrub off my fake tan um and scrub off every layer of my skin i feel like i need to get my hair out of my face where is my headband 
I need to stop yapping now guys so I'm gonna pop you on a little time lapse while I get ready and I will speak to you probably after the meeting meeting done everybody and i am just about to get something to eat because it is now i think it's half past 12 um actually i think it's one o'clock i can't i don't even know what the time is um there he is off to work he goes callum's on a late shift this week sad time so yeah callum is on a late shift which means he is about to leave for work because he starts at one o'clock um, my mum's actually popping around in a minute um, I'm not actually sure what time but she just texted me saying that she was going to pop around at some point so it'll probably be soon um, but I'm going to get something to eat beforehand because I am really hungry it's been a while since I ate um, the meeting went really really well um, I I'm really excited actually it went really good so I've had a good productive morning I've had a little bit of a tidy up of the house so that's looking good and yeah i'm gonna get something to eat i then think i am gonna sort out my wardrobe after my mum leaves um i'm obviously not gonna vlog when my mum's here because nothing really interesting happens we just waffle and chat a lot do you not like the lemon ones callum's looking at my turkish delight i showed you the turkish delight the other day guys um, it's there and I basically demolished all of the rose flavoured ones. I do like the lemon, they're just not my favourite. My favourite is the rose flavoured Turkish Delight. So good. I don't really know what I'm in the mood for today for lunch. I'm probably just going to snack and then have a dinner quite early on. Um, because we're actually going to yoga tonight, me, my mum and my sister. My mum and my sister Jasmine have been to this yoga place before. I haven't, so it's my first time. And yeah, they told me that they'd gone and I was like, oh, I wanted to try yoga. So they've invited me with them today. So that's where I'm gonna go this evening. I think it's at about half past seven, quarter to eight. I can't remember um but yeah we're gonna go along for that i don't know if i'll be able to vlog it i really want to but i don't know what people's rules are and how busy it's gonna be because i think that it would be really interesting um and i want to do a little bit of meditation later and journaling so as i said earlier i'll talk you through all of that in a bit but first things first i'm gonna eat of course i have gone for a halloumi wrap because it is my all-time favourite at the moment. Also, guys, I did my What I Eat in a Day video the other day, and I actually used oil, but this week I have switched. Well, actually, was it last week? I don't know. It might have been last week, or it could have been... No, it was definitely last week. <laughs> anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, but I actually started using this sunflower oil, the Fry Light one, and it has been a godsend. I have already seen a difference in my weight. I have dropped weight so much quicker. Um, it's obviously because it's only one calorie per spray and I only use like a few sprays of it and it is just so good. So if you haven't tried this and you're considering something else other than oil, I really, really recommend this. They had loads of other ones as well. I think they had coconut oil one and they had maybe rapeseed oil. I can't remember, but they had loads of different ones. Um, why is my camera just focusing on the Turkish delight, please? <laughs> So I'm going to get on and eat this because as I said, I'm starving and my mum should be here soon. So I'm going to eat this and then she should be here. So then I'll speak to you after. Also, just me again, quickly, before I eat. I finished Gilmore Girls the other day. Oh my gosh. I loved it so much. I think I got through it. How long have I been watching it for? Can anyone remember how long I've been watching Gilmore Girls for? Like when was the first time I mentioned it? because I can't remember. It's probably a good like couple of months I've been watching it because there are like eight seasons, I think, and there's 20, 
two episodes per season i think that's right so to be fair i've got through it pretty quickly and i just loved it i'm so sad that it's over like i've i've watched all of it now that's it um so i am actually watching gilmore girls a year in the life i think that's what it's called i understand that it only came out a few years ago i think it was like 2016 um but obviously i didn't watch it back then so i didn't have a clue that it was probably a really big deal but i didn't have a clue about it um so i'm currently watching that i'm on episode three and there's four episodes so again i've got through that pretty quickly i started watching it the other day and i just absolutely loved the show it's gonna be definitely one of my comfort shows i can guarantee it so I might re-watch it at some point <laughs> in the next couple of months. I just enjoyed it so much. So if you guys haven't watched it and you want something like super cosy and just really nice, like a comfort program, then I definitely recommend watching that. It's like set obviously in America. It's, I think it's an American show. And the town that they film it in, which is called Stars Hollow, um, which is the town that they live in, is just so cute and then every season they decorate it so like i love the episodes where it's like autumn and they've decorated it all for halloween and it's just so cute so i really recommend that if you want something to watch That's dinner done. How was it, Mum? It was fantastic. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Why have you got me looking like this? <laughs> no one cares. You look lovely. We are off to yoga. <laughs> <laughs> Mum's still adjusting to the camera, everybody. <laughs> Even though I've been doing it for three years. <laughs> She's still not used to going on the camera. Um, we've just had dinner. Sorry, I actually didn't film anything before dinner or like before I made it. Um, but later on, I'll talk you through what I used in the dinner. Um, but for now, we're going to yoga because we will be late otherwise. So we're going to get going. And I'm not sure if I can vlog there. I'll try to. If not, I'll do it on my phone maybe. Um, but we'll see how it goes. I'm home from yoga, everyone. It was... Um, really good and relaxing at the end um we went to one 
in Kemsey, if you're local. And I really enjoyed it and it was really difficult. It was so difficult and I'm aching. Let me just turn up the uh, brightness because it's rather dark in here. Well, we're still going to go to the gym. I know, we're going to the gym as well. I'm absolutely insane. Um, so yeah, we're actually leaving in a minute to go to the gym. I've literally just got home. My mum dropped me back home. Um, so yeah, it was really nice to see her. I didn't have a chance to talk you through the burrito bowl, but basically what I did was I made obviously some for me and my mum and I did, I think it was just under 300 grams of chicken. So obviously we had 150 each. Then we had half a pack of rice each, which is the coconut rice that I've shown you from Aldi. It is amazing. Then we had some sweet corn, some red onion, lettuce, um i made homemade guacamole with avocado obviously sour cream salsa and light cheese like grated cheese sprinkled over the top only a little bit though um and it was so good i don't think i've missed anything so that was really really nice i really recommend i actually found it on tiktok so i if i can find the tiktok i'll link it down below but i'll also put all of the ingredients in the description box below as well because it was so good so yeah i think i am actually gonna carry on this vlog tomorrow as well mum was actually here for a long time so i haven't vlogged as much as i thought i was going to today so i will vlog probably tomorrow i haven't sorted out my clothes which is something that I definitely need to do tomorrow and I'm going to definitely do some meditation and journaling tomorrow the yoga class that we went to tonight was also really nice because it incorporated some like mindfulness and stuff into it which I really enjoyed so you kind of do a little bit of meditation um it was just really nice and then she did this thing at the end which I don't know what it's called but she like put oil on like here and here it was like when we were med not meditating but we were relaxing and it was at the end of the session and you kind of are lying there flat on your mat eyes closed kind of just taking breaths and focusing on your breath which you could probably say is meditation um because that's what you do in meditation and then she came around and did this thing with oil and it was just nice it was nice and it made me feel really relaxed and i could have fallen asleep so that was really really lovely i think i am gonna go every week with my mum and my sister so yeah that was really nice i've had a really nice day actually it's been really lovely to see my mum i'm actually going around there tomorrow as well so i'm spending a lot of time with my family this week and yeah it was just a really good day so gonna end it with the gym and then probably come back have something sweet i might have um, i don't know what i want maybe a banana with some peanut butter or something that sounds nice so i'll see what i fancy when i get back so yeah let's go to the gym oh, it's been 27 nights without you here by my side and I've been counting every hour Cause since you stepped out of my life Good afternoon everybody, it's now the next day and I've just finished filming a video um, I'm not sure if you'll see this video before or after I think you're seeing this one before so Friday's video is actually going to be a favorites video which so many people have been requesting and I finally got around to actually filming one so that's really exciting and it's going live on Friday so today I'm actually <laughs> not really doing much I definitely need to sort out my clothes which I said I was going to do yesterday and I also really want to do my journaling today and also my visualization and meditation so I've already talked you through journaling before so I might talk you through my visualization manifestation thing today and then later on this evening I'm actually going to my mum's house for dinner and then I'm going to the gym with my sister so we've got a not like a really busy day today but i have got a few things to do um obviously i've just filmed so i had that to do 
but I'm glad that that's done because that's one thing off of my list. So I think I'm gonna pop into the bedroom, sort out my clothes now. I'm actually watching on my phone a Cinderella story, which is a throwback. Does anyone remember a Cinderella story, the film with Hilary Duff? I used to love that film so much when I was a child, like a teenager as well. Um, like young teenager and I haven't watched it in ages so yeah I have got that on on my phone and I think I'm gonna get on and do my wardrobe because it is horrendous <laughs> like so bad so that'll be another job off of my list so that'll be a very productive afternoon so let's get tidying the wardrobe wardrobe done everybody i was gonna tackle the drawers but the wardrobe has taken me so long and it was exhausting you know i had so much stuff in there that i completely forgot i even had that's how bad it was so i'm really glad that that is done i actually did it like a few months ago and i literally cleared out so much stuff like half of my wardrobe and I've just done a further, I'd probably say I chucked away like a quarter of it. Um, which is good going considering not long ago I chucked away half. So it's a lot tidier now, which is great. So now I'm actually going to sit here and do a bit of journaling. I'm going to do my visualisation and meditation. So for that... I normally pop my headphones in and I will listen to a video on YouTube. You can find so many different meditations on YouTube. I really like um, visualisation ones. I will pop one of my favourites down below, which I'm actually going to do today because I haven't done that one in a very long time. And it is just really nice and calming and... I don't know, I'm just in the mood for something very relaxing. Last night at yoga, I literally left feeling so relaxed and then I went to the gym. But I I just felt really good last night. Like I got into bed and I felt really happy and I want to continue that feeling. So I'm going to do some nice meditation today. Excuse these pillows, they're still here. <laughs> As you can tell, when I went to B&M the other day, I didn't find any cushions that I liked for the sofa. So I'm going to have a look online, I think, at some point and order some new ones. But cushions, right, guys? When did they become like £20 a cushion? I just can't believe it. And you've got to get like four for this sofa because it's an L shape or maybe like three. But yeah, blooming hell, being an adult is just... A different vibe isn't it so yeah i'm gonna sit here and do some journaling and i'm gonna pop you on a time lapse while i do meditation i don't know how i'm gonna look doing this but <laughs> oh well i know that you guys don't care but yeah i'm gonna have just a really relaxing few minutes probably do it for about half an hour and then i'm gonna make my way to my mum's house so yeah let's do that Once my heart was in pieces i told myself that was
guys, that is it done. I'm feeling so relaxed and like sleepy now. Um, that's one of the things I have to try not to do while I'm meditating. I have to try not to fall asleep. I actually just sit how I kind of feel. I know that a lot of meditations say to sit upright. Sometimes I sit like this with my legs crossed. Sometimes I actually lie down. If I do meditation in the evening, like before bed, I will always lie down in bed because I just find it comfier and um, it gets me feeling more relaxed. So yeah, I've done my meditation for today. Um, I've done my journaling and I actually think I'm gonna wrap up today's video here because I'm popping out to my mum's. I'm not gonna be vlogging tonight. I'm just gonna spend time with my family. I haven't seen my brothers for a while um, and like spoken to them and had a conversation because every time I go around they're at um, school. So yeah, it's gonna be really nice to see them. So thank you so much for watching today's video. I've really enjoyed spending the past couple of days with you. Don't forget to click the like button if you enjoyed it and also subscribe to my channel if you're new i post videos every wednesday friday sunday and friday's video is going to be the january favorites love you guys so so much have an amazing rest of your week and i'll see you on friday bye